Ladies and gentlemen, if you haven't already, please click the subscribe button, and if you're feeling extra crazy, drop a like and turn those notifications on. Another weekend has passed us by, and that obviously means another foot champions has also passed us by. As you saw in last episode, we managed to secure the gold one, as well as, I'm pretty sure we are pretty confident in saying we've also secured Division 1 rank 1. So we should have some decent rewards come Thursday. And fingers crossed, there might be another informed Cristiano Ronaldo. And that is obviously what we're trying to get. Now, if you haven't already, ladies and gentlemen, make sure you are subscribed to the channel. Road to 250,000 subscribers. Oh, that was a good, that was a good one, that was. And uh, if you haven't already, drop a like on today's video. Because in today's video, we're saying goodbye to someone who, honestly, was just so good for me this weekend league. So, so good for me. Uh, this is my, this is the, the uh, Champions League squad battle team that I've been using. But the first team is currently looking like this. Here it is, ladies and gentlemen. We've actually put Armstrong back in to mix things up a little bit. But basically, in-game, we've started to play at the 4-4-2 with it looking like this. So you have Rooney and Eto up front uh, with Mbappe on the left, who's quality. Petit in the midfield, who's like our defensive midfielder, which will be very important very soon. You'll find out why. And then at the moment, we've just got Armstrong on the right. I think that may change at some point. But the reason why I'm showing this is that I want to start using Petit more. He's going to be our centre mid. Yes, we have the options of the bench. They're fantastic. Don't get me wrong. Kante, Ben Arthur, Curtis Jones, and obviously N Nakata. And as you've probably quite worked out by now, uh, we are missing a player. And that is, of course, Prime Moment Steven Gerrard. In fact, we have sold Prime Moment Steven Gerrard. Unfortunately, I didn't get a screenshot of his stats. But, I mean, you all know how good he was for us. He was fantastic. The reason why I sold him is that he's 1.4 million coins. I sold him for... 1,361,000, so I only lost like 50k on him, which is actually not that bad for a Prime Moments icon. And I want someone with a bit more attacking prowess. So I want someone to partner Petit in the midfield for the next weekend league. And uh, that player is going to be a team of the year. I'm not going to tell you who just yet. You'll have to wait and find out in just a second. But obviously we've said goodbye to Stevie G, who were honestly was so, so good. Him and Wayne Rooney in that midfield were absolutely quality. But Rooney's been promoted to a striker. Gerard has been sold. Goodbye, Stevie G. We're waiting for Bartley to sell. Hopefully he sells for a nice tasty 30k. But in objectives, ladies and gentlemen, mega matchup. We've done one out of the four. We've assisted 10 goals in squad battles. Uh, obviously, we are trying to complete icon swaps, so that is done in squad battles. We are we're going to get there eventually, hopefully by next episode. And on season progress, we have unlocked a prime gold player pack for level 24, which you absolutely love to see. So we have a 75 plus and obviously that prime gold player pack. A lot of people would save their prime gold player pack to try and save it for the next promo. I, however. I'm not. I'm just looking for the fodder because I do actually want to do um, a a mid or prime icon pack. Obviously, it's repeatable. Uh, I'm trying to build the fodder up. So off camera, I'm doing a lot of the 82 to 88s. And in the prime player pack, no bore. That is unfortunate. I'm doing a lot of 82 to 88s off camera to try and build up that fodder for it. Well, that was a, that was a very, very bad pack. As I was saying, uh, I'm trying to... Do a lot of those 82 to 88 rated packs, upgrade pack to try and get the fodder for the middle prime icon pack. There's an 86, an 85, and an 84. I think I have enough fodder for the 86 rated squad. I won't do it just yet. Maybe I... No, I won't send it off just yet. I want to I wanna build up the fodder to try and obviously do the 84 and the 85 at the same time. And we need to do another icon pack because I'm not ending on Nakata. I'm not going to have that be the legacy of my icon pack luck. However, ladies and gentlemen, it is now time to buy that player we are after. I said it's going to be in the team of the year. And obviously, it's going to be a midfielder. And there's only three team of the year midfielders you can really pick from. You've got Bruno Fernandes, Kimmich, or De Bruyne. And of course, we're going to be going ahead and buying ourselves Kevin De Bruyne. Team of the year. Oh my god, he's a little bit more expensive than uh, Stevie G. He's about 1.6 million, so he's about 200k more expensive than Stevie G. But again, he's a 96 rated card, and I think he has that a bit more. He has that bit more attack and prowess, you know. I think he's a five-star weak foot, four-star skiller. So fingers crossed, he is worth 1.6 million, and uh, he plays like an absolute beast for me. Though the quickest, the cheapest by now is 640. So let's do a little. Let's do a bit of 610 and see if we can win it. Oh no, this is very unfortunate. I've just gone on. And I, I put a 1.611 1, 1. million on, and there's one that potentially might 
end up going for less than I've just bidded. And, it, and it's in 30 seconds. Oh, this is annoying. Oh, no. Oh, we're going to watch it. We're going to watch it go in front of our eyes, aren't we? I wish you could, like, retract a bid. Why can't I retract a bid? Oh, I wish they could add that feature into FIFA 22. Retracting a bid would be so ideal. We're going to watch this going for cheaper than the one we've bidded on. We're going to have to wait three minutes and inevitably someone's going to outbid us for this one, aren't they? Lastminute.com. But the 1,606,000 is going to go in front of our eyes. Oh, we've wasted 5k. Oh, that's frustrating. Right. I'll see you in three minutes when hopefully we can win this bid. We have 13 seconds to go. We've had to bid for 1,613,000, but this could get us the Kevin De Bruyne we're after, and it will save us around 20k. Uh, from the buy now. Have we got it? Have we secured it? Yes, we have. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Eto Sections. Welcome to the club. Team of the year, Kevin De Bruyne. Now, this is our first team of the year in the club on FIFA 21. And, mate, I'm excited. I pray to God. I've heard some big, big things about this card. Is it four-star skills, five-star week? But it is the perfect centre mid to partner Petit in the middle of the park. So, let's whack him into the starting lineup and I've just realized he won't give Tav any chemistry whatsoever which is not the worst thing in the world it's not the worst thing in the world we can mix it up we can mix, we can find a way of getting that chemistry um I didn't really think about this did I the only option to be honest is unfortunately Tav you will have to get dropped and do we have Kyle Walker still I believe we do have Kyle Walker we do so unfortunately Kyle Walker's gonna have to go in uh, at right back Kevin De Bruyne is on 8 chem which is not what we want um, is there a way of making this working I'm sure there will be a way I'm sure of it okay we've worked out a way of doing it we've changed the 4-1-2-1-2 narrow so Kevin De Bruyne is now on 9 chem uh, and everyone, everyone's on full chem essentially uh, we just need to convert Petit to a Cam, obviously Mbappe doesn't need to be converted to a centre mid because he's got 10 chemistry, which is fantastic. So this is now the team we are going to be using. Uh, we're going to take it into friendlies just to, just to give it a try. And uh, yeah, let's try out this brand new Kevin De Bruyne. And our first opponent has another Eto. And oh my word, was that was that mid R9? The 94 is 94 his mid card. I think it might be. So, okay, so against another Eto and an R9. So we've actually got a pretty decent team to play against to try out this new Kevin De Bruyne. Oh my god. Oh my god, we're in. Mbappe. Oh my god, we're in. Armstrong. Armstrong picking up a loose ball, plays it into Mbappe, and Mbappe gets it in the back of the net before he's even had a chance to go to left mid. I've just realised De Bruyne hasn't got his first touch for the club. Finally, here it is. He's on the ball and plays it into Petit. Back into De Bruyne. Oh, here he is. I'll just absolutely whack it. Nah, I need, I need to chill out. I need to chill out. <laughs> well, so let me get this straight. You have R9. I understand you have R9, but his tactic is just to sprint with him. And I, you know what? I, I gotta respect it. And it's worked out. It's one all. Ooh. Oh, yes. Oh, mate. The interception from De Bruyne. The pass into Rooney. The skill from Rooney. And the goal from Eto. That is 2-1. Well done. Well done. I don't know where my defence was there, but it's 2-all. Eto isn't missing from there, is he? Let's face it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Eto. Oh, I should have taken it closer. Maybe gone for the tramp. Oh, he's making a lot of mistakes, this guy. I, realistically, I should be beating this guy. Come on. Yes, Rooney. Yes, Rooney. Oh, he's put it wide. The halftime stats are saying that I'm dominating. And I got to admit, I am. I feel I feel like it's just one of them games where... I, don't, I, 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 I hate to say it, but I think I'm stooping down to his level. I should be winning this. Oh, hell no. No, 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 no. Bruno Fernandes. Oh, it's a great save by Schmeichel again. I tell you what, Schmeichel's kept me in this game, he has. Come on, Petit. Get the ball back. Here we go, Mbappe. Oh, no. Oh, no. 
Not like this. Not like this. Kyle Walker saved me. De Bruyne. Here we go. Eto. Up into Rooney. Here we go. Eto's open. Eto is open. Can he get the ball in? Yes. Touch. Bang. Yes. Three all. We knew what we were doing. Now it's time to go ahead and win the game. Oh, mate. Oh, mate. Just give it to Wayne Rooney. And he'll finish his dinner every single time. We're finally winning in this game. Oh, R9. <laughs> Bloody R9. Oh, he's too good. He's actually too good. Please, R9. Not like this. Wait, what? Wait, what? Schmeichel had it in his hands. Ref. Ref Schmeichel had it in his hands. Oh, please don't score this free kick. Where is it? Oh, my God. It's there. I mean, where do I even position my players? I don't want to put a player on the line either. If he's going to score it, he's going to score it. He can take the goal. I'm not that guy. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. It's off the woodwork. Can we get one? Can we get one? Rooney. Rooney. De Bruyne. He's in charge now. It's De Bruyne. Armstrong. Armstrong. Oh, Armstrong. Armstrong, we've got a corner. We've got a corner. Right, we need a great, great delivery from De Bruyne here. Come on. Onto the head of Wayne. Oh, Marcelo. Oh, Marcelo. Oh, it's off the bar. Oh, my lord. We've both hit the woodwork. Oh, my God. It's not over. Armstrong. Armstrong has won it at the depth. Oh, my word. Oh, my word. It's Armstrong. Oh, my God. Oh my god, that is the 92nd minute, and we've only gone and won it with basically the last kick of the game. There is confirmation of the 5-4 victory. We made it so much harder than it probably should have been. But game number one ends in a De Bruyne debut and a De Bruyne win. Let's test him out in game number two. And the opponent has Kaka and player of the month Messi and... Jao Felix. So last game we were against Eto. This game we're against Kaka. Man, it's all these opponents, they're just destined. They're destined for something to do with my series. Oh my god. Oh my word. I'm sorry. What, De Bruyne? Okay. Okay, so when I get the ball, give it to De Bruyne, shoot from anywhere and it will go in. Or De Bruyne can just tackle. Play the through ball into Eto. Near post. Oh, I, I could have tramped it. I could have ran and tramped it. But I'm not about that life. Maybe I should have done. Why have we given it to Rooney? Marcelo. 99. Accuracy on the headers. And yes. And yes. 2-0 inside 8 minutes. And we've got ourselves a rage quit. And that is 2 wins out of 2. Kevin De Bruyne, welcome to Eto's Excellence. I'm looking forward to getting the real test of De Bruyne, which will be in foot champion and division rivals from Thursday onwards. But, mate, this team with Armstrong, fingers crossed Blackburn can get those goals and he can get upgraded to get himself even better. But this team is sick. I'm having so much fun with this team. We're giving Tavernier a bit of a rest for now, you know, bringing in Kyle Walker. And to be fair to Kyle Walker, he's doing a job at right back. We've got super subs coming out of our ears. Robin, Gomez, El Sharawe, Sobolo. Lost guy is our hero. He is the Bibiani of this series. He is so, so good for us off the bench. But we have some objective notifications, daily objectives, and week five. Week five? Week five bronze are done. And we shall end this episode there, ladies and gentlemen. If you have enjoyed it, be sure to drop a like and subscribe. If there's any other players you want me to try out before we go ahead and get Prime Moments Eto on episode 150, do leave your thoughts in the comments down below. And I will see you all tomorrow. Bye bye.